Awesome. Hey, guys. Hi. Uh, I uh, just got to thank you all for uh, contributing to uh, my childhood, certainly in my generation and further generations. And I thank you both. Thank you all for coming. Uh, You're I welcome. Know, you probably won't mind if I just, you know, shoot my question here real quick. I know that uh, the con does it already and Evan Tainment's probably got it covered and all that. But I just wanted to shoot this one question. Um, and uh, and my question is, there we go. My question is, here's my question. My question is about uh, vocal effects, uh, mainly for the actors, for, for Greg and Laurie as well. Um, you know, in terms of vocal effects, w we were so lucky, uh, those of us that were here in 2016, to meet Frank Welker. Uh, when I got to meet Frank and chat with him very briefly, we talked about uh, doing animal noises and how he's one of the best. Uh, but he also touts you, Greg, as one of the best, too. He calls you one of the best barkers in the business. Uh, of course, working with Frank on uh, Garfield these days and so many other shows that you've worked with, uh, that's quite high praise. Um, I, the question I asked Frank and the question that I want to ask uh, you, you both actors today is about doing vocal effects like animals or any other kind of vocal effects. Uh, do you ever do it like in kind of, <laughs> it's kind of funny, but do you ever do it in like kind of funny, embarrassing situations where you're in your car like doing maniacal laughs or, or trying to do just some kind of a crazy character when you're out in public and do people look at you and go, what, what's going on with this guy? But he's just practicing, you know. Have you ever done that where you're just, I got to practice this and I don't care where I am and I'm just going to do <laughs> voices because you love it? <laughs> Hell yes. Hell yes. <laughs> Worst for me is in my own house when I think I'm uh, alone and I'm uh, essentially rehearsing or, or just <clears throat> doing something stupid and, and my wife or my, my kids would, would say, what? And I, I'm just, I'm, I was just in my head uh, practicing yeah. something. <laughs> yeah, it's always true. Speaking of Frank Welker, if you don't know, he could do anything. Anything. Uh, when we were doing... Uh, uh, Ninja Turtles, the second Ninja Turtles movie. I was Raphael, and Frank was there to do everybody else. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Not, Toka only, and not only human or animal. There was one point where they needed Frank to do the sound of a old rusty gate opening and closing, and he just did it. So that's the kind of thing that he could do. I want to jump in and comment that there is one uh, show for which uh, I've done voices. I produced a show that you can find at Amazon Prime uh, and some other venues called The Grand Kingdom of Cookie Land. And Cookie Land consists of uh, all kinds of puppets interacting with kids. And I was the voices of all the puppets and was the puppeteer for for all of those puppets. Wow, wow a one man And they, they were very mischievous, uh, Grand Kingdom of Cookie Land, very mischievous uh, puppets and a lot of liars among them. <laughs> and one little girl had a lie detector. She wires the puppets up and uh, she calls them on their, scolds them on their lies. <laughs> so you might look for the Grand Kingdom of Cookie Land and that's the only uh, instance you'll find of Paul David's doing those voices. Good for you. That's, <laughs> That's awesome. Nice. You did, uh, everything. Did, did you ever practice those puppet voices in person, Paul? Or I like practiced in public, them I mean. in the car, in, in the shower. <laughs> uh, I'm sure no one in Los Angeles would think differently when you're in that crazy rush hour traffic doing crazy voices. You just assume someone's upset about the traffic or something. And well, they're like, ah! You know, they're losing their minds, you but see it on they're the really just acting. All the time. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> right. People just write it off as road rage. Right. <laughs> Thank you so much for answering my question, guys. Thanks for coming. Thank you. Sure.